Well, there is still no word from the Louisiana Supreme Court on if they've gotten the appeal from Henry Whitehorn over the Cano Parish Sheriff's race lawsuit. And by law, a request to the high court to hear the case must come within 48 hours of the appellate court decision. Yesterday, it was a 3-2 to two vote by the Second Circuit Court of Appeal that upheld a Cano District Court ruling for a new election between Whitehorn and John Nicholson. Nicholson has maintained there were irregularities in the early and absentee votes, plus evidence that two people voted twice. We are staying in touch with the Louisiana Supreme Court, and as soon as the appeal is filed, we'll let you know on our KSLA News 12 app and at KSLA.com. And earlier today, the Louisiana Democratic Party sent out a strongly worded statement on the court decision in the Caddo Parish Sheriff's race. Louisiana Democratic Party Chairwoman Katie Bernhardt said, quote, protecting our democracy has never been more important. The voters of Caddo Parish have spoken, but John Nicholson and his benefactors are trying to take us back to a world reminiscent of Jim Crow, a world of exclusion, control and violent inequality. She went on to say that the Louisiana Democratic Party stands on a fair election process. We understand that every election may have irregularities, but the issue in this case is that Nicholson failed to prove that these irregularities changed the outcome of the election, and they definitely did not change the fact that he was the loser in this election, end quote. And tonight, our Dominique Ben and Stephen Maxwell investigate the one vote victory. We dig into the alleged voter irregularities and how we got here, as well as an eerily similar case that happened in the Arklatex nearly 25 years ago and much more. You can watch our special coverage right here on KSLA News 12 at 6 p.m.